What's up guys? In this video, I want to talk about Say or Say Network, a layer one crypto I've been buying over the last week or maybe two weeks now. It's a VC backed scalable layer one that's built with engineers from Robinhood and a ex banker from Goldman Sachs. They have strong connections, a ton of money back in it private investors. They still have roughly 50% allocated to the public. They're roughly a 500, 600 million market cap priced at 25 cents. Just got launched less than six months ago. It is on Coinbase, it is on Binance. They have a lot of connections. Coinbase Ventures is one of them, okay? They have a lot of people that want to see it grow and succeed. And if you're trying to catch a layer one, that is fundamentally sound. Say it's definitely not a crypto to overlook. It has a rumored speed twice as fast as Solana, which if that is verified in the case, that is a very big feat in of itself. Solana is known across the crypto world as the most scalable blockchain. So Say has a chance to really rocket ship. And I think it's more than just a chance. I think it's in fact likely to happen. A lot of people are calling this a scam right now because they botched their airdrop, which is fine. Who cares? I mean, Optimism also botched their airdrop from what I understand. So it's not a deal breaker for me. I wouldn't call it a scam because of that. Like it, it is what it is, right? I don't rely on airdrops to become financially free. But that being said, I have a very good feeling about Say. Now, keep in mind the circulating supply is very low, 20%. They have a 10 billion total supply, so the inflation's high, and the VCs are locked up for at least a year. Okay, so they can't take profits until at least August 2024. But a lot of them are considered smart money because they have tons of money. And what does smart money do? They take profits usually at the right time before retail does. A lot of us expect this big profit taking stage to take place in 2025 sometime in 2025 right so i can't imagine these vc and private investors dumping their supplies on 2024 late 2024 now anything can happen if it suppresses the price so be it i'll buy the dip but at least we know they have to hold on to this for at least a year right so it's good from an accumulation standpoint i love layer ones i think they have the best risk to reward the former robin hood software engineer jay jog i watched his uh interview on why he started say what drew him to it and him having a lot of experience on the back end of robin hood a very popular exchange a stocks exchange that's known in crypto i think he knows what it takes to market say okay marketing and connections do matter and say maybe it's not the most fundamentally sound crypto it's proof of stake definitely not the centralized but it's scalable but their connections will matter. These VCs backing it will matter. There's a reason why Solana made its way back into the top 10, top five, because the VCs matter. It's popular. They're good at marketing. There's a lot of interest in it, okay? If you can draw interest and hype for a crypto, sometimes an imperfect crypto can rock a ship like this. How many times have we seen this? Solana last bull cycle reached around 100 billion market cap, if not more. That was a crazy feat. It was once 50 cents. It went up to $260. Say to me is like buying Solana sub $10 right now. That's a very big discount when you look at it from that point of view. Now keep in mind, Say can very easily get to $5 this bull cycle, which a 20X from here is $5. That would put it at a 50 billion market cap, which is half of what Solana did last bull cycle. If Say has the same parabolic run that Solana did last bull cycle, it could reach $10, which is why I'll put it in the $5 to $10 category for this bull cycle. But I'm more conservative, so I'll say $5. A 20x from a crypto whose chart looks very bullish and just reached a recent new all time high of 30 31 cents. I think Say has a lot of potential. And I'm willing to bet a lot of these investors who are calling it a scam, they're going to be looking back on this day, you know, in the future and wish they got into Say at 25 cents or sub 20 cents. There's a time to have deal breakers. There's a time to pivot. There's a time to reevaluate. But I've been researching Say now for quite some time. And the more I research it, the more bullish I am on it. So it's definitely a crypto I've been DCAing into. I've been posting my buy alerts on Patreon and Discord. By the way, if you wanna see these alerts, if you wanna join me, talk to me, run your portfolio by me, be a part of voice chat hangouts, 
live streams, which I will be doing in a couple weeks, then definitely check out the Patreon and Discord. We'd love to see you there. But yeah, Say is definitely a crypto, especially a newer one that I think is going to rip it. We cannot underestimate how powerful VCs are. Okay, Solana was a crypto. I really wish I got in at a dollar or two dollars or sub ten dollars. I am not missing that boat with Say. Say looks very good. I like the team, their docs, they're on big exchanges. Someone asked, why would you buy Say when it's on Coinbase already? And I'm like, well, that's the point. You buy it in the early stage of the bull market on a centralized exchange, and then you watch the rip, okay? Cardano got listed on Coinbase in March, 2021. And when did Cardano reach $3.10? In September that year, which is what, six months later? Say could very well rip it. And don't forget, Say has a fifth of Cardano supply with VCs behind it. Say can easily blow past $3, and I think it's going to get to $5 minimum this bull cycle. So I'm very, very bullish on this crypto. I am still researching it. Anything new that comes out that I think I should share with you guys, I will let you know. But I wanted to bring this up to you guys because it is a new crypto that I feel like a lot of people aren't aware of. Make sure you research it. Make sure you don't just take my word for it and say, okay, great, he's bullish, he's buying it, I'm going to buy it. Always be your own investor, always spend time researching, always be skeptic, but just don't be so stubborn to where you just look at a crypto and say, okay, it's bad. Like, I don't have that mentality when it comes to crypto. I love investing into plays that I think are early, and I very well think, say, could be a sleeper crypto in this bull run but now i want to hear from you have you heard of say and if so where do you see its price by the end of 2025 drop your comment down below and let me know if you enjoyed this video please leave a like it really helps so much that being said i hope you have a great day and i'll see you in the next video